Brown and Councilor Kelly, did you want to introduce your motion? Sure. Thank you very much, Mr. Mayor. Whereas on June 14th, 2023, City Council approved amended staff recommendations with respect to curbside waste diversion in the City of Ottawa, lowering the garbage put out limits for curbside household to three limits bi weekly. And whereas solid waste services are currently in the process of implementing a phased rollout of the new three item limit with the final phase to begin in December 2024. And whereas some residents in Ottawa have had oversized bins <clears throat> that historically have been collected at their laneways with no enforcement action taken by collectors. And many residents were likely not even aware of the already approved 140 liter limit for containers that was in place prior to the shift to the three item limit. And whereas residents who are receiving non-compliance courtesy tags during phase enforcement periods are reporting that although their bins are oversized, they are putting out a lesser volume of garbage than would be permitted in three separate containers totaling 420 liters of garbage. And whereas it is difficult for residents to even locate bins that can contain the maximum volume of up to 140 liters as described in the city's bylaw have already owned these bins for a period of time. And whereas it would be beneficial to allow for additional time for residents to be able to locate different bins on the open market once they are available instead of having to adapt to three item limit and the need for smaller bins at the same time. And whereas solid waste services staff are also in the process of looking at options available for the disposal of these oversized bins, given that they are not going to be accepted for collection. Therefore, be it resolved that solid waste staff be directed to ensure that residents that are using bins larger than 140 liters or 33 pounds continue to receive curbside collection for a temporary period of up to six months, so long as the maximum capacity within the bin does not exceed the total three item capacity of 420 liters or 99 pounds. And be it further resolved that during this six month period, solid waste collectors play a courtesy non compliance tag on bins that do not comply with the solid waste services bylaw, indicating that there is a temporary exemption being granted in order to educate residents that they will need to locate different bins. Be it further resolved that after this temporary period, the maximum capacity would continue to be 140 liters or 33 pound bins, as described in the solid waste service bylaw. Yeah, appreciate the the fact that this conversation is happening. I will echo uh, Councillor Brown's remarks uh, in terms of this being a team effort from rural Ottawa. Um, but I also, based on some conversations this morning that I've had with some of my colleagues, realize um, that other councillors have been receiving complaints about uh, this particular uh, restriction and the rollout of it and enforcement. And and I want to be clear that this is not about at all dialing back the uh, the curbside limit uh, that we put in place last. June. Um, that was a 22 decision and I'm not under any illusions that, that will convince council to overturn that, although I probably have some residents who would like us to do that. But what I think we do have here is an opportunity um, to correct an oversight um, by at least providing a six-month exemption on enforcement of bin size and lid restrictions. Uh, I do understand and I'm sensitive to the health and safety concerns that have been raised by operators, but um, this has been, these bins have been successfully collected um, for a decade at least uh, with this bylaw in place. And we're now about to enforce this limit with no real viable options available for people to buy these commercially. Um, one of the reasons that people use these bins is to keep wildlife out. They're made of a thicker plastic. They have wheels. Um, oftentimes in the rural setting, you're, you're going down a very long driveway. This can be very tedious for, for elderly people particularly. Um, and, and these bins really do help keep wildlife out. And there is no comparable bin at the 140 liter limit available currently. And uh, I think it would be more fair for the city to allow there to be multiple options commercially for people available before enforcing this. Um, I, I think maybe I'll end there. I think it would be a, a fair approach to to allow people to to continue to use their oversized bins at least until there are some available for them to buy. Um, I'll leave it there, and we'll open it up for debate. And I'll have some uh, closing arguments and questions after. Thank you.